My name is Matt Hand. I am the owner of Hand in Hand Productions uh, and currently am working on an internet station, channel, whatever you want to call it, called Show Up Central Oregon. Well, good afternoon and welcome to another edition of Show Up Central Oregon. Uh, hope you're having a good day. I'm uh, excited to have a good conversation this before the quarantine, I was actually heavily into the event business, and so I would do a lot of AV event support in addition to producing some videos for those events. The biggest event that we do is an event that would have normally happened this time of year, which is TEDx Bend. We field a 26-person tech crew usually during that, but most events that we do, we have at least a 6 to 12-person tech crew. In the moment that Kate Brown gave her order that there would be no more events and that uh, social distancing was going to be required, uh, it was devastating. I literally probably went to the lowest point that I had been in in a long time. I wasn't sure what I was gonna do. The reality though is I was raised by a couple of really great parents and in times like this, they've instilled on a really positive sort of, hey, you gotta do something for the community. And I sort of was like, I know how to do these things that maybe I can produce content that can potentially benefit the community. And within a couple of days after um, the order came down, pretty much built an entire studio in my house. A good way to look at what I do right now is, is essentially a new studio. I've referred to it as a network operations center and I can bring in people from around the world now and put it out. In fact, we just did a stream today that we had somebody uh, you know, from Egypt actually joining us, which was such a which was such a cool thing to, to know that he was joining us from Egypt. And it's all basically being handled in, um, let's see, probably, oh, 100 square feet, basically, uh, which is amazing to think about how technology has advanced at this point in time to be able to do that. The show up Central Oregon came from listening to a podcast. There's a gentleman by the name of Dave Ramsey, and he talked about this is the time that we all need to show up. We'll get through this. We'll all be okay. And immediately I just created some sort of graphic that night with, you know, show up Central Oregon because I was determined the next day to really brand it and start to go forward. And it wasn't for me, it was for the community. I'm really committed on trying to find programming that's that's valuable to the community. I'm super concerned about mental health right now, and I'm trying to figure out what I can do to, to speak into that and to lean into getting better programming so that hopefully one person, and that is really truly what it takes, one person, you know, can can get that impact and it becomes a ripple within the society today. I've never been in front of the camera really. And now every day it's more and more. And I, I actually think that this is the start of something completely different for my career, something different from my business, something different for me. I think I'll always do events, but I know that after doing what I'm doing right now, it's changed the whole dynamic. And in the future, it's going to be very much a, this, I have to continue to do this. There's so much good happening and so much information that needs to be out there. Video is such a powerful medium to do that. Why not make it happen? It's Wednesday, which means it's time once again for Josh to join us for a positive talk with Josh. Hey, Josh, how are you, sir? I'm doing great. Thank Good. you, Matt. How are you? I, you know, honestly, I'm going to be honest, Josh. I'm a little, I'm in a little bit of a foul mood right now. One of the videos that seems to get the most traction is two guys talking about their feelings every Wednesday night. For me, that means a lot that uh, we're providing that content. And again, that's not paid content. That's me and a friend of mine just talking about how we're feeling about today and keeping positive attitudes and, and just making sure that we're doing the right things for our family and for ourselves. I can honestly say that this experience has been a... an amazing experience. Um, <laughs> to go through this absolute chaos, this absolute just horrible spot of not knowing what is going on and yet knowing that I bring a little bit of hope. I bring a little bit of joy. Um, I bring love to people. Those are the things that for me are just such a blessing. Um, 
and the community has rewarded me also. I had probably one of my busiest work weeks between my own content and paid work that I've had in probably eight, nine months. We all have hope, we all have joy, we all have love, and let's spread it around. With many of the shows we do, we try to, to reinforce the fact that sometimes the easiest thing is to just go next door, um, call a neighbor, call a friend, call a loved one, and just, just be there for them. Just show up for those precious moments that you might have. It just changes their lives and it changes your own life in such an amazing way. All right, everyone, I'm signing off for the night. I appreciate it very much. And uh, you guys all have a wonderful evening.